Pink skunk A N E M O N E F I S H. Amphiprion paradarion, sometimes known as the pink skunk and fish, is a stunning and well liked marine fish with distinctive markings and a vivid pink hue. Coloration True to its name, these anemone fish are mostly pink, with a range of shades from a light pinkish white to a more intense, vibrant pink. Their body is either pale pink or white, and they have a characteristic wide pink stripe that is edged in white and runs horizontally from the base of the tail to right behind the eye. Usually, this pink stripe is followed by another thin white stripe. Size When fully grown, these fish have an average length of 2.5 to 4 inches, 6 to 10 centimeters, making them rather small fish. Markings Pink skunk and emmon fish have a single pink stripe in addition to their distinctive pink color. Their fins may also display a tinge of yellow or orange. Behavior These anemone fish form symbiotic relationships with certain species of sea anemones. They live within the tentacles of these anemones, finding shelter and protection from predators among the stinging tentacles. In return, they help the anemone by removing parasites and providing nutrients. Habitat they are commonly found in the Indo-Pacific region, particularly in the waters of the Philippines, Indonesia, and parts of Australia. They prefer sheltered lagoons and reef areas with a variety of coral formations where anemones are present. Diet Pink skunk anemone fish are omnivorous. Their diet primarily consists of small zooplankton, algae, and occasionally small crustaceans. In captivity, they can be fed a variety of prepared fish foods suitable for marine omnivores. Reproduction. Like other anemone fish, they are protandrous hermaphrodites, meaning they start as males and can become females. In a group of these fish, the largest and most dominant fish is typically female, the next largest is the breeding male, and the rest are non-breeding males. These fish are popular among aquarium enthusiasts due to their vibrant colors and relatively easy care in a well-maintained saltwater aquarium. However, it's essential to note that they require specific conditions, including appropriate tank size, water quality, and the presence of anemones or suitable substitutes to mimic their natural habitat. Thanks for watching.